let's all look at Parent Song by Jeremy Zucker and Chelsea Cutler. Uh, I know you guys are actually excited to learn that uh, finger picking part, which actually goes for most of the part of the song. Mm-hmm. And I do like feel like adding that uh, strumming for that Jeremy part where he actually sings. So it's gonna be super easy, no capo snatching. Let's quickly have a look at the chord shapes. The first chord is a G, 3 2 open, open 3 3. In the chord chart, we will not see the third fret on the B string, but it's there for the song. Then we have a D, which is mute, mute, open, second, third, second. E minor, 0 2 0 0 0. C, mute, 3 2 open, first open. Four basic chord shapes which are required for the song. And now I'm gonna break down each and every stuff for you guys with tabs, maybe moving a little bit faster. Never mind. So, firstly, before providing you with the tabs, I just wanna say I'm using my thumb to hit the bass note of any chord which may be on the E or the A or the D. So the thumb is for the bass note. Then I'm using my index for the G string, my middle finger for the B string, and my ring finger for the high E string. So keep that in mind, just practice a little bit, and then you'll actually ready to go. So let's get started with an intro. We start off with the G major chord, where we just have third fret on the E string, and that's it. Just third fret on the E string, top E. And we play the top E string, and the B string, and the E string, and the B string, and the G string. So we got pang jay pukera, sa tang ring takera, e b e b g. This is the pattern. And now when you just cope up with this one, you will see this actually gets repeated for all the chord shapes. The same pattern. So we have pang ring pukera. We just gonna play that twice. And now we actually move on to a B minor chord. Uh, no B minor bar chord. Just we have second fret on the A and third fret on the B. That's it. And now you're gonna play the A string, then the B string, then the A string, then the B string, and now you're gonna lift off that ring finger, making it open on the B string, and play that once. So we have So this time it's E B E B open. You can actually play it like this. So it sound more original, but uh, bar chord comes in a little bit, so just wanna avoid that. So it was. Then you're gonna go to a D major chord, you hold, play the D string open, then you play third fret on the B string, open D, third fret on the B, open B, second fret on the G, open G. And this is the a pass, so we got. That's it. And now just hold the D major chord and now we just gonna change the strings but the pattern is same. So hold the D major chord and we play. So we play the D string and the high E string and the D string and the high E string and the B string. So yeah. And again you just gonna repeat this four times. So we have ding, ding, ding. So D high E B D D B D E D E B D E D E B it goes two more times. So starting we play the G twice, B once, and D once, and then comes to the D major chord playing four times. Now you go to a E minor chord. You have second fret on the D, open G, third fret on the B, more likely a E minor seven. You play D, B, D, B, open G string. So, boom, ding, ring. And you again play this pattern four times. So, you see, repetition of pattern, but just uh, you change the strings because of the bass note and all stuff. So, we have four times, three, four. And now comes a C at nine, just a C major chord, third fret on the A, third fret on the B, A, B, A, B, G. Again, four times. Now I'm gonna put up the tab down over here. I'm gonna play this part once slowly. Let me give you a better view.
it's gonna be very hard at the very beginning if you're not familiar with the finger picking but once you get to it once you actually learn this one the other stuff will be just a piece of cake so let's have a look at the Jeremy Strumming part uh, where he sings we have the chord, uh, chord progression G D E minor C super simple uh, make sure to subscribe guys if you haven't yet come on subscribe uh, string pattern will be down up down up and this will be going four times on each cut so you have down up 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 so down up down up into four so goes once on each cut down up 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 down so let's go for the whole song so guys that's basically everything for the song if this video helps you out make sure to subscribe if you haven't yet and also drop a comment down below and again guys subscribe i'm actually working a lot out for you so you must subscribe that's it bye